One of the great benefits of uh, hydraulically powered water pumps is the compact size of them. I'd like to show you a couple of examples of that. This pump here on the edge of the, uh, edge of the table, the maximum water pressure is 90 bars, 1300 psi, and the maximum flow is 150 liters per minute, 40 gallons per minute. This pump weighs 11 kilos, meaning 24 pounds, and the water output power is 12.5 kilowatts. That means approximately one kilowatt per two pounds. And then we have slightly bigger pump here. The power is 40 kilowatts. And uh, the weight of the pump is 36 kilos, 79 pounds. So this pump is also approximately one kilowatt per two pounds. The power to size ratio doesn't get really better than this. These pumps are made out of uh, better quality materials for, for more demanding situation. These pumps are made for subsea use and uh, seawater is one of the most harsh and demanding places for any water pump. This water pump is made out of a special aluminum bronze alloy, which has really great mechanical and chemical resistance. And this pump is made out of stainless steel to endure all the, all the seawater sea effects and fulfill the subsea use requirements. Let's take a brief dive into the pump technology. Quite normally, hydraulic driven water pump is a triplex pump where you have an attached hydraulic motor. Then the hydraulic motor is powering the gear mechanisms and crankshaft inside the pump casing. And then with a piston rod, you finally get to the actual water piston that is pumping the water. But there is also a different way to do that. Okay, this pump is made with patented Dynaset technology. I'll explain the basic function of this pump. First here in the middle, we have hydraulic piston. And the hydraulic piston moves inside the pump back and forth. Directly to the hydraulic piston, we have secondary pistons, which are pumping the, actually the water. So this system replaces all the gears and crankshafts and, and all of that, what's normally in, in triplex pump. So let's take the situation where this piston assembly is moving to your right. First, the hydraulic pressure is directed on this side of the piston, and the hydraulic power pushes the piston assembly to your right, which forces the water out from, from here in the end to the pressure channel through the water valves. When it reaches the, the final position, the, there is a valve inside the hydraulic piston that automatically changes position and diverts the flow to the other side of the piston when the piston assembly moves to the other direction, and then again, and then again. So that is the basic structure and function of this pump. With this technology, we can make a hydraulically powered water pump even smaller than normally. And uh, with this structure, you don't need any programmed maintenance. The water pistons, they don't need any any lubrication and the hydraulic part is lubricated by the hydraulic oil itself. This was our short introduction to the hydraulically powered high pressure water pumps. As you see, they are very versatile, very flexible, and they don't get any more compact than this.